All right, so what's going on everyone? Swan here, and today, as you can tell, I'm actually gonna be talking to you about why you need to be using the Builder Pro setting in Fortnite. Now, this is a setting that's for PS4 and Xbox that I think really changes the skill gap. It makes the skill, skill gap a lot smaller from PC to Xbox and PS4, and it, the setting kind of seemed to fly under a lot of people's radar, so I'm gonna try and shed a little light on it and show you why it's actually needed to be used. If you're, tr if you're trying to become a much better Fortnite player and a quicker builder, this is 100% the option that in the route that you should be taking. So moving quickly into here, I'm just gonna give a quick overview of what it is and the differences between something like Combat Pro. So Combat Pro, of course, you had to click L1 and R1 to rotate through your structures. And in this, so you click circle, of course, to go into the build mode. And then once you get there, R2, we're starting with R2, that's still that's still a wall, you just build a wall right away if you want. But this is where it changes. So stairs are L2, roof is L1, it's one of the pyramid things. Uh, a wall, of course, is your right trigger. And then R1 is a floor, one of the flat ones, or it can be used for a ceiling, just one of the flat structures. And then square is trap. And to actually place them, so this is just a to toggle to them. You click it once to toggle to. So if you want to make if you want to build the stairs, you click circle, go into your building, and then you click L2 and it goes to stairs. And you can either hold it down as you click it and it'll build it, or you can just double tap super quick and then it'll build it. And then so if you want to build Let's say you switch to building, build a wall, and then quickly build the stairs, just click L2 twice. And you can just skip through the whole switching to each thing, and it'll just go straight to stairs. Now, I'm gonna go into a game real quick and kind of show you it in action, and just try and explain what's going on and why it really is just something that you really need to use. Oh! All right, I had to just, there's one guy chasing me, and I had to, I had to kill him so I could actually get some material. All right, so now I'm just going to get some material and just kind of walk you through and kind of explain everything about Builder Pro. Okay, so I got material. Now here, I'm going to build a quick one by one and just quickly explain what is happening. Here, we'll find it right here so I can demonstrate a good one. So here we go. I'm going to build a floor too with it. So I go right here. Just like that. Look at how fast that was. Okay, so I'm actually here. I'll build it with the stairs too, so I can show that it's just switching straight from straight from walls to stairs. So I go over like this, and I messed up right there a little bit, but uh, I think you got the gist of it. All right, hold on. All right, well we're gonna we're gonna showcase a building fight real quick. If I don't mess this up. Wow, okay. There we go. There's just a good example of a building fight. Now the storm is coming in, so I'm just gonna head in a little little bit and carry on from there. All right, so now I'm gonna give you some quick examples of different things that you can build so much faster in Builder Pro. So, I know you see a lot of streamers, if you watch someone like Ninja or Myth, when they build stairs, they commonly build walls like up, like this, right after them. and. Builder Pro allows you to actually switch from stairs and walls super fast so I can do it. Look, like watch this. I will stay running this whole time and I'll build a I'll build a a wall after every stair. So you go like this. Look at how fast that is. Sometimes I I need to get better at it, but you can build two stairs and two walls, which is another thing a lot of PC players are able to do and not console players. All right, here we go. Now, see that it's it's really hard. It's definitely much easier to do on PC, but it's still you're still able to do it. Plus, if you're just rushing one person, it's not like you have to build two sets of stairs to do it. And I like to say it again. It's so key that you're able to build walls and stairs. And one by ones, especially people love one by ones. So that's that's one of the main keys. It's super easy to just 
build super quick. What just happened there? Okay, we'll go like this. Just build up super quick. Here we go, here we go, we're going for him. We're going for him. Where is he? There he is. Okay, well he's gonna get caught in the storm. And that might just kill me. Oh, he, he actually died. Okay, well he died from building too high. Well, I died, but I, I think I got the point across and kind of gave some, gave some examples. I truly think that if you're trying to get better at this game and want to get bit better at building specifically, uh, you, you definitely need to switch over to the setting and I hope, I, hope this, I hope this video helps. And if you can get used to these settings, you're gonna see your gameplay improve. You definitely will, 100%. But you know what, people have preferences, you know, maybe maybe you just don't wanna switch over. If you're the casual player that really only plays one game every here and there, a couple games, hops on just once every couple days, whatever, doesn't care to get better, then you know what, maybe you don't wanna do this, cause this, it, it can take a little bit, if you're not used to currently building in your other settings, then this might take a little bit, but, I highly recommend it. I, I really do. Epic did a, an amazing job with creating a way to build in console that is similar to PC and really lowered the skill gap a lot more than I thought they could. But anyways, thank you. I hope this helped. I hope you're all having a nice day. See ya.